According to latest reports, the indigenous aircraft one, which shall be called as INS Vikrant once it enters the services with the Indian Navy, had successfully began another set of sea trials on Sunday for carrying out complex maneuvers in high seas ahead of its planned induction in August. The 40,000-ton aircraft carrier, which is the largest and most complex warships to be built in India, successfully completed a five-day maiden sea voyage in August and underwent a 10-day sea trial in October. The keel of the 40,000-ton warship was laid in February 2009, while it floated out at Cochin Shipyard, which has built it in December 2011. Basin trials were completed back in 2020 and the vessel is expected to be commissioned into the Navy by August 2022. Apart from this, according to the Indian Navy, the Indian Aircraft Carrier 1 shall operate the Russian-built MiG-29K fighter aircraft and CAMOV-31 air early warning helicopters, the indigenously manufactured advanced light helicopters and the soon-to-be-inducted MH-60R multi-role helicopters which have been manufactured by Lockheed Martin. While the maiden sea trials were to establish propulsion, navigational suit and basic operations, the second sea trial witnessed the ship being put through its paces in terms of various missionary trials and flight trials. According to sources, INS Vikrant has over 2,300 compartments designed for a crew of around 1,700 people, including specialized cabins to accommodate women officers. As per officials, Vikrant has a top speed of around 28 knots and a cruising speed of 18 knots with an endurance of about 7,500 nautical miles. India's sole aircraft carrier at the moment is the Russian origin INS Vikramaditya, which entered the services in 2013. The Navy is looking at deploying 36 multi role fighter aircraft that will cater both to the INS Vikramaditya and the new Vikrant.